must be hard to do a movie about giant monsters. Godzilla, King Kong, Jurassic Park, they all have monsters, some of which we can feel emotions for. So in the movie Hulk, you'd think you'd learn a ton about the monster's emotions and struggles. Nope. This movie wanted to be a character study. It wanted to run off the emotions and atmosphere rather than have a huge epic story. It wanted to give us weight, none of which I can feel. I know nothing about what Bruce Banner is feeling and I can't really relate to him when nothing seems to affect him, or anyone for that matter. It's sad because the rest of the movie has a beautiful tone to it, but it isn't backed by a 100% great script, for me anyway. I don't care about the Hulk, or his father, or the general, or the girl. They are all just your basic archetypes who become stereotypes. Not well done stereotypes either, just boring ones. That's a good word to describe this movie, boring. Which is weird to say because this movie is fast paced. The editing keeps jumping from one scene to another and it has weird comic book panels. It's trying to bring the comic book to life, but I think I think it's just sort of awkward and not fitting with the tone of the movie. You want to know the plot? Well, Bruce Banner is a scientist, survives some dangerous explosion, then becomes a Hulk. And that's basically it. The Hulk is chased down here and there, but nothing much left to say. There's a subplot about the father that I honestly have no caring for. Man, this movie was a bore. I mean, I can see the work that was done for it, and I can kind of see where Ang Lee was going but it never hit me on any level. What's weird is that every line of dialogue is exposition. No offhand comments or conversations to make the characters relatable, it's just serious moment after serious moment that tried to match up with the awkward editing. Yeah, I can kind of see why the movie didn't have a sequel. The effects are, well, kind of outdated. But I think the filmmakers knew that because it really isn't a CGI extravaganza. They instead try to hold this movie together through emotion that I honestly felt nothing of. It was a failed experiment to me, and definitely is not a movie for mainstream audiences. This is not what I pictured as being a Hulk movie, and while I give credit to Ang Lee for trying something different with the material that has a very obvious story, it just didn't work for me in the end. I don't feel complete seeing this movie, and honestly, if you haven't seen it, don't worry about skipping it.